I am Karen Stratton. I'm the director of this year's musical, The Color Purple. I'm also the theater director at Pike High School. I'm directing plays all year long, and, and it's always musical time in the fall. And I find that theater, and I find that musical theater is, is an avenue that lets our young folks show a different side and be able to be more life positive choosing life in, in a way that um, is unique. Um, well, my name is Sophia, and I'm Harpo's wife, and I'm a friend to Celie. And I just do a lot of stuff around the show, like being friends to people and not taking no drama from nobody and helping people determine who they are. First of all, these students have put in a ton of hours. They have been required to commit a lot of time into a musical that talks about a lot of things that I would say our community at times is not necessarily even ready to approach. So to, to have the students working and being a part of a musical as serious as this musical it's something that the community needs to see. Everybody and it's important. Everybody plays a specific role because everybody feeds off of each other. Everybody adds up equally to the whole musical. To everybody personally. I play the character of Suge Avery and we get to reflect like background, history and from back to the old days to how so much has changed to modern if you if you look and think about it and then so much has what hasn't changed and some, how some stuff is still the same. What about love with Suge? That's probably one of my favorite pieces in the play. You know Suge is leaving me and Celie doesn't want her to go. Celie wants her to stay and it's, she just found who loves her, the one person who loves her in this world, and that person's leaving. So it's, an impor it's important in the play because it shows their relationship and how strong of a bond it really is. I've always desired to do this musical, The Color Purple, because it's not just a, a musical about one woman's struggle, but all of our struggle to find what's uniquely ours, our, our life ability to love who we are and who we've been created to be. My favorite number in this piece so far will probably have to be push the button. The students have worked really hard at executing the movement but at the same time creating an atmosphere that is fun, that allows people to be free, to, to dance and not hold back. Very proud of everybody here. And I just look forward to us, you know, building more as a family and working together to make this production as good as possible. It's just been a really fun ride. I'm really excited to see how the whole thing is going to turn out. It's been so much hard work, and I, I'm ready for it to pay off. If Oprah could come see this show, it would be the most worthwhile experience that I could ever have in my life to just see somebody who does so much for this world. Um, to be here in little Indianapolis just to come see us, it would be the greatest honor probably any of us could have. We ask you, Oprah, you, audience, to join us in the celebration of life, love, and the gift of finding who you really are.